Saving an attachment to iBooks is easy. You find the attachment on your iPad, tap and hold the document to reveal a menu, then select Copy to iBooks. But there's more to iBooks than just saving files. You can purchase books to read on your iPad. And purchase doesn't always mean dollars with Apple. There is a wide variety of free books you can purchase or download to your iPad. Let's take a look. Locate and tap iBooks to get started. In the iBooks menu, located at the bottom of the screen, you will see a variety of options. The first is My Books. This will be a list view or shelf view of all the items you have saved to your iPad. Just like in the App Store, there are several ways to search for an item. You can search for a specific book with the search field to the top right. You can search for new books that are trending in the featured selection. You can even see a list of books recommended by the New York Times. But for those of you looking for free books, you will need to tap Top Charts. On the left, you will see a list of paid titles, and on the right are the books that are free. You can swipe up on the list to preview the items. When you find a title that strikes your fancy, tap Get, then tap Get Book. You may be prompted to enter your Apple ID password. Another way to find free books is to tap Top Authors. On the side menu, select Free. Then scroll through the list to find the author of your choice. Tap the author's name to see the available selection for that specific author. View the titles. Tap Get, then tap Get Book. Enter your Apple ID password if prompted. Now, all you have to do is tap My Books to view the materials you have installed. Remember, iBook materials can be read offline. That means if you don't have Wi-Fi, you can still read the treasures stored in your iBooks.